It was only a matter of time before Savathun showed herself. She is not capable of letting this moment pass without placing a claw on the scales. For now, she has exactly what she wants. Uncertainty. We will take that from her. Track down her brood, and pull back the veil from her plans. Mara Sob, so eager to spar with gods at the drop of a hat. Aren't you tired of losing to me? I seem to recall your logic rebuked. Your ghost being imprisoned by the Vanguard. That tastes of anything but loss. The sword logic was always tarnished. But your bomb logic also went down in flames. Quite spectacularly, if I do say so myself. Two queens. Failed by ideology. We adapt or die. And it's a new age. Isn't that right, your majesty? See it yet? The end of our little game, buried between memory and material. Between dark and light. What trinket from the past holds your attention so? Not a trinket, a perspective. The knowledge of angles, of edges, and the points at which they end. A convincing argument. From Sister Superior, you could say. your efforts on destroying them and releasing their energy. As much of it as you can. a finger on the scales. The darkness inside of you is searching, like standing on the threshold of being taken. 
You see how they see. Savathun's plan was never about hiding anything, but revelation. Look for what is out of place, and bend it back. Ugh. I cannot hold it any longer. I feel the Traveler's pain too, you know. Without me, the Witness would have swept Saul away a long time ago. How noble of you. I am sure your intentions were pure, with no ulterior motive. Play an unwinnable game, meant to extend on forever. And I've shown you how to change the rules time and time again, without even a thank you. There will be a day when you've run out your usefulness, witch. When you will have no greater scheme to protect you from our wrath. I will hold as long as I am able. Wait. I... I feel light. But it's... out of phase. A light fissure. But it exists in an entirely different state of matter than we can normally perceive. But the Taken can. Ah, you figured it out. Just in time. Here they come now. This one comes to your aid, Guardian. You need not fight alone.
are fissures of light all across the Pale Heart that exist out of phase with the material world, ones brimming with potential. Now that I know how to find them, I should be able to help the Traveler. Then we're both getting what we want. How nice when light bearers find mutually beneficial outcomes. You're welcome. And thank you for not interfering as much as you could have. <laughs> Words spoken on borrowed time. You only live because a threat more pressing overshadows you. Oh, there's no need to flatter me. You can save your love for later when all of this comes back around. If you're so interested in helping, call off the Lucent Brood. Help us fight the Traveler's enemies. Guardians, always wanting more. <laughs> Don't look a tithing thrall in the maw, little ghost. Stand together, on the precipice of annihilation. All our battles and all our losses have led to this moment. One final battle against the architect of the Collapse. One last step together, into the end. In spite of all the power the Witness has, we stand undefeated. We have endured endless tragedies, endless losses. But we come back fighting. Today is no different. Just a god of darkness. We got this, right? Together, we do.